Now, we're going to dive deep into the world of boundary enforcement. This is where we stand tall, where we stand proud, where we stand strong, and unapologetically be the best versions of ourselves. And there's going to be two really crucial things that you're going to need to remember during this journey. So get ready to just brush off all the haters and embrace your inner strength. First off, we're going to talk about those narcissists who just aren't keen on you setting boundaries for yourself. No, they don't want you, you know, cramping their style or holding them accountable. These narcissists, we'll, we'll, we'll call them boundary busters. They don't want to take responsibility for their actions. And guess what? They're not going to be fond of this new improved you, which means awesome. It doesn't matter what they think because, you know, they don't matter. Only you matter when it comes to boundaries, setting them and enforcing them. But here's the deal. This new version of you, this empowered boundary setting you, is here to stay. And those narcissists can throw their little fits and tantrums if they want. Sure, yeah, there was a time when you used to let the mark all over you. That was, that was before. Now, now you don't. Then yeah, they're going to react. They're going to be, look at me. Now I'm a victim. Look how mean you are. <laughs> it's freaking meaningless. They're going to play the victim against your boundaries. It'll happen. Oh, right. But it'll happen because look at you. You're going to be like this just shooting star just blazing across the sky and just illuminating the path for others to follow. Narcissists, yes, they will resist. Yes, they will push back. But this is your chance to, you know, practice staying firm, to just confirm and commit to your resolve.